Archangel Michael is saying that you don't need to talk to him to fix this. He's saying you just need to forgive him. Don't you hate that? Don't you hate it when people tell you to forgive? That sucks. You know why it sucks? Because sometimes you don't feel like forgiving someone. Sometimes you just be mad at somebody, right? And you're just like, I don't want to forgive you right now. You are hurting me. You hurt my feelings. I am mad and I'm indignant about it, right? Did I go too far? Pissed off state. <laughs> right? So I never recommend that anybody just, the message for her from the angels was for her to forgive. However, that's never the first step. Now here's what I teach my students and my clients about forgiveness. Step number one, talk about your experience. So get a good therapist. By the way, I do offer angel counseling sessions. It's not a pitch, I'm just letting you know. I guess it's a pitch. And the second thing is take responsibility. Now she cannot take responsibility for what her dad did or didn't do. That's not the kind of responsibility that I mean. I mean take responsibility for your patterns, right? If you have a pattern of feeling sorry for yourself, if every time you get hurt, you shut down, you become addicted to feeling sorry for yourself, that's, that's on you. That's the pattern that, that you, know, you have to change that you and I would, could work on. And then the last step is, is forgiveness. But unless you've done those first two steps, the forgiveness ain't coming. I don't care if you're Deepak Chopra, Wayne Dyer, it's not gonna happen. Because that's just the way we are as humans. When our feelings get hurt, we get so constricted, right? This lady in the front row going, no, I forgive easily. Anybody forgive easily here? One, two people, three, yeah. It's, it's hard for most of us. So, so work on that, okay? Thank you so much. Thank you. You're welcome.